Welcome to Pencil Jelly. Hello! And we've got Kelly here again with an amazing headband of her own. Thank you. Now we look like twinsies. Yeah, yours is bigger, but wow. yeah. So um, today we're going to be reviewing erasers. Oh, I have so much to say about erasers. Like, which ones are the best? Which ones? So do we go with a nice traditional pencil topper? What about the classic pink pearl? And you know what's big these days? Little novelty erasers. Look at that. Dinosaurs. OMG, I'm a dinosaur. Okay. Yeah, yeah, so. No, wait, should... wait, wait, wait. Oh, oh, oh little llamas. Okay. These okay. two llamas, guess what? They're BFFs. Oh, oh, yeah. Okay, so um, we have quite an extensive review from we Kelly, so mm -hmm. we will um, go to that. Okay. Okay, so we're going to start out with the trusty end of pencil marker. These have been going on been around for a long time. So here we've just got some regular pencil. Nice, nice. Look at that. Almost takes it all away. Did a little lighter on the pencil right here. Think it'll give us um, a better result because we weren't pressing down too hard with the pencil on this one. So you can see a lot better, a lot better there. Um, we also have some colored pencil. Let's see what we've got going on there. Oof. That does not look good. That does not look good. We'll try it on a different one. This is just your basic, just your basic colored pencil. We're gonna see if we can erase it. You are getting some of the color up, but not a lot. So as you can see, we're starting to lose that nice point on the top. We're going to try crayon next with this pencil eraser. I'm really having to press down hard and look, I'm barely, it's barely taking any of it off. Okay, next we're going to try a nice thick novelty eraser on all of the different types. We've got Pencil. Okay, pretty good, pretty good. Um, works as well as the uh, pencil topper. Okay, not as well the more pencil that you get. It's still keeping most of its form. I'm gonna try a different one because I'd like to see if it leaves down any color. So again, this is our colored pencil that we're trying with this one. And you're seeing, again, we're not getting any color off with this one. I'm gonna come over and try these colors. I'm getting a little bit better, and I think it's because they're lighter colors. Let's try the crayon, see what happens with the crayon. Now, still gonna get a lot left behind. Now, it's mostly keeping its shape. We're not having any of the eraser color left behind. Next, we're gonna do a little llama, any cute? I'm a llama, look <laughs> at me. Three-legged llama, I think that's a thing. So we're gonna try him out first with just some regular number two pencil eraser. And you see, works fine, works fine. Again, we're gonna come on over I have to do a little more vigorous to try to get some of this colored pencil off. Let's try a lighter colored pencil. Again, not getting a lot of it off. Let's come on over to the crayons. Barely touching it. Now, we're getting, look, he's already basically lost an ear, lost his feet, so for the llama, there's a lot of misshapenness that's coming to him as we erase. Uh, now, we also have a little dinosaur. I have a feeling because there's so many thin parts of this eraser that it's really not gonna, not gonna do a good job. So let's see. Okay, it's very fumbly because they're going in different directions. As you can see, I didn't get as much off 
of the number two pencil lead as I would have liked to, as I've seen before. Let's again go back over to our colored pencil and see, I'm having to add a lot, a lot, a lot of pressure and I'm getting basically no result. Let's try the crayon over here. Still not much result. Now I did a little bit of pen. I just wanna try, just wanna try a little bit of pen to see if it even is gonna do anything to it. It is not. Now you see, of course, the eraser. It was very hard to do. I feel like his little feet are about to fall off. He is not as decorative as he once was. Um, it gets the job done. It doesn't leave color down, but it doesn't look very pretty afterwards. I say stay with the functional end of pencil eraser for your erasing needs. All right, good times. So here is the verdict. Um, I reviewed the, um, you stick it on the end of your pencil eraser. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure what those are called. Um, and I did do the pink pearl eraser and I would just say, you know, they do as expected. They, um, they erase pencil, they erase colored pencil pretty well. They can't erase crayon or pen, you know, but they do fine. And there's just the one disadvantage of this one, you know, this thing will happen uh, and yeah. it, oh, it drives me crazy. Yes. And then also that weird thing when they kind of like change their chemical composition and they get all plasticky and leave like a weird that mark. Weird mark. Yes. I hate that. Yeah. So, but enough of that, you know, if you do use this or the pink pearl, you're in good shape. Okay. Um, so we'll go to Kelly because her review is quite a bit more thorough. Absolutely. Now I took on novelty erasers. Now here's the thing though with novelty erasers. They do the bare minimum. They took off the lead, the number two lead off the paper. They didn't really work with colored pencil or crayon. Um, now here's the thing, if you want to use novelty erasers, you're gonna not want them back in mint condition. Because hey, here's the, yeah? That's my llama eraser. Yes it is, uh-huh. Okay. Um, because you're gonna have to put a little extra pressure on to get everything off and it's going to... Um, what did you do to those? It looks like you ate them. Uh, no, I was rubbing vigorously with them to get the, get the lead off. And so they're not gonna come back in good condition. If that's no. something you're looking for, then what you're gonna wanna do is not use them to erase. Okay, so basically novelty erasers, you're not supposed to use them for what? for erasing. If you want them to stay the exact same that they are, you're gonna not want to use them for vigorous rubbing of pencil lead on paper, stuff like that. You can use a good old trusty eraser on the bottom of your pencil. Okay, well, so that's our review of erasers. To sum up, just mm -hmm. stick with your, your typical eraser and novelty erasers are used for Novelty. 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 Okay, novelty. Okay, yeah. All right, so thanks a lot. Uh -huh. And I'll have more reviews of art supplies for you coming soon. More. I like that. <laughs> Vigorous rubbing the lead out. Rubbing the lead out. Vigorously rubbing it. <laughs> Vigorously rubbing the lead out. No, they taste terrible. This is from vigorous rubbing.